Now to that historic test flight of SpaceX's Starship. It is now the most powerful rocket to reach orbital speeds. The launch happened just after 9 o'clock this morning from Boca Chica, Texas. News 6's Mark Lehman watched the liftoff as it happens and explains the exciting strides made with this test flight. Such an exciting moment for Starship from the moment it lifted off from the launch pad in Texas. SpaceX making a lot of progress from the last test flight a few months ago. This is now the fastest and farthest Starship has ever flown before. For the third time in the last year, SpaceX tested the world's most powerful rocket and all cylinders were firing. We are feeling the rumble. We are seeing 33 out of 33 Raptor engines ignited on the super heavy booster. Nearly three minutes into the flight, an important milestone. Starship separating from the heavy booster, split screen of the two giving stunning views as the booster approached a splashdown in the Gulf. Some engines failed to reignite. We're getting a few, a few engines. The booster making a hard splashdown in the Gulf, but this flight made it much further than the previous two tests, both ending in explosions. Today, Starship carried on, escaping the Earth's atmosphere. What an amazing sight to see Starship there in outer space. SpaceX giving a view inside as teams opened the payload door and demonstrated a satellite deployment. About 30 minutes later, Starship began its re-entry. Oh man, we can see the heating on those flaps as we're starting to re-enter the Earth's atmosphere. The ship then losing communication and was destroyed as it made a hard splashdown in the Indian Ocean. SpaceX, though, is counting all of this as a success and an important step for its next test flight. A lot is riding on all of this as NASA is planning on using Starship to eventually take astronauts to the moon and even beyond. Mark Lehman, Getting Results, New 6. And you can watch the mega rocket launch again. Just head to clickorlando.com and find the story right on the homepage.